Listen, man, we got another Aaron on anime reaction. Shout out to Aaron, you know what I'm saying? Why Roxanne is the best purchase in anime? Labyrinth? 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 Is that my saying that right? Labyrinth? In another world. My man said purchase. We can get ourselves a Roxanne, bro? Where? I'm trying to cop, you know what I'm saying? Hold on. Your boy found the greatest oh, waifu know. that you've never heard of. Thank you, your dream waifu build. Strong, funny, busty, macaroni sound. All oh, shit. One person. Now, the character I'm talking about <laughs> come from a show called Harem and a Labyrinth. I ain't gonna lie to you, gang. When Labyrinth. I first saw the show, I don't know what I originally anticipated, but this wasn't it. And I ain't gonna lie to you, gang. It was hard as hell. Harem and a Labyrinth is your <laughs> one-of-the-mill isekai anime where our main Man, character, up, Micho, who is... What the Run of the mill isekai anime where our main character meets her. All right, buddy, what are you doing? What are you doing? Yo, who is that dude? He that boy for real. Look, I know we ain't talking about him, but Micho, bro, Subaru would hate Micho. He, he, he's everything he wish he'd be. And I ain't gonna lie, Issei? You're not that guy, pal, trust me. Nah, Issei ain't guy. even in a ballpark with my boy. Emotional. But basically, Micho gets trapped in another world and one thing leads to the next and we end up with the title. Now, the character that made this show a hit was our baby Rock. Roxanne. The ginger, you're not saying. Roxanne is the greatest wife of oh, 20. Oh, whoa, 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 bro. Why does bitch look smooth? Roxanne. Ooh. Nah, bro, this shit look clean as fuck. It's the greatest waifu of 2022 hey. and hands down deserve to be in the waifu hall of fame. Now, gang, yeah. I can already hear you. What about yours? What about Orihime? What about Miracle? What about Power? Hold on. I'm vibing with her right quick. Hold on. Bible. What, what's up with you? You're not saying. Hold on. Look. We're not talking about them, and I'm not saying they not gonna be in the waifu hall of fame, but they weren't going in before Roxanne. Roxanne is 5'2 with auburn eyes with chestnut mm. brown hair. It's like it's like a little blind, you know what I'm saying? It's a blind brown. I was like, like a okay, little ginger, cool. orange. The show is so new, we don't even have the quantifiable numbers, we don't have the bust, we don't have the hips. We don't have none of that, but what we do have is our eyes and everything singing. I mean, oh my God. We must think oh, this, brothers. Now, oh, one oh, more oh, thing oh, I oh. have to- I gotta see that little- Oh my God. Look at this shit. I feel you, gang. We must stay focused, brothers. Now, one more thing I have to add to the attributes because this is the first one of its kind in the Waifu Hall of Fame. She's a demi -hue. Now, look, 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 hold on, hold on. Your Who's boy, that? I'm not a furry. I'm not like not that. That's not me. But I ain't oh. gonna hold you. When I saw her, I was like... <laughs> <laughs> now Roxanne is the first <laughs> member of Micho's party and his first slave and I know I know when you hear slave it's getting kind of crazy and look gang me and the word slave and slavery we already got history so I'm already <laughs> feeling what you feeling anyway I also know where your Fuck mind name, went bro. because my mind went the same place when the slave master was selling her it went like this you know I got slaves for sale you name it, I got it. Look, I got what you need, what you want. Look, you ever thought about buying slaves? Look, look, hold up, hold up. Hey, hey, shut up. Bring us some tea up in here. Now, I ain't never really think about buying slaves before. I'm gonna I'm be honest with you. I ain't never really thought about it for real. You know what I'm saying? Oh, holy <laughs> damn, <my> damn. <laughs> yeah, you that see bitch is right in your face, cuz. You know what I'm saying? Oh, that's holy, <laughs> holy Jesus, my God. What? Yeah, you see a right, I didn't do nothing. Yeah. Yeah, she could be everything you want and need. The imagination is limitless, and trust me, gang, she's down for it. After our boy Micho heard that, he was down. He was like, I gotta get Roxanne by any means necessary. And our boy Micho, bro, Micho got wicked. He was going to stop Jeez. at nothing to get hey. Roxanne. And can you blame him? Like, can you blame him? Now, once we finally get introduced to Roxanne in a personal setting, in bro, a setting her arms are like this, gang. She's like this, regular, right? Regular. On they're, they're down on her side, regular. Them bitches is sticking out this way, bro. Hold on, this way, bro. They're covering like her bicep area, bro. 
can you blame him? Now, once we finally get introduced to Roxanne in a look at this shit, bro. God damn. A personal setting and a setting away from the slave master. We get to see who she is, and we get to build out the scouting report. And the first thing we throwing on that joint, she is dependable. Whether it's yes, her sir. sharpening gears, no matter what, the girl is loyal and dependable as hell. She went so far to tell Micho this, Master, I die for you. I do anything for you. I take a dragon Bro, them bitches. up my ass, Master. Master, yes. I'd I'd have sex with thirty trolls. Master, I'd get gang by snow mountain elves in the winter master i swallow listen baby you looking like that you ain't gotta do none of that freaky shit you hear me that's for you and me you're not talking about for you and me simple a horse for you master there's nothing i won't do to keep you alive i would go i would fight god for you master master i love you i need you master there's nothing i won't do for you master roxanne i don't i don't need you to do that i don't calm down I don't need you to take that dick. No, relax. I'm just saying if I die, that you'd be you'd be free. No, master, you're not gonna die. You need to understand, master. Bro, I am your sword sitting, and your boy. shield. Look, all I was trying to do ah. is write a paper that said I was gonna free you if I die. I don't want to be free, master. All right. Shorty was willing to die to protect this man by all means. Now to say you you willing to die to protect somebody, you gotta be more. You can't just say that. You gotta be able to prove that that dependence that someone can depend on you. Because sharpening yeah. gears, sharpening our swords, that ain't enough all the time. <clears throat> and Shorty could back up what she was talking. Rock sand and rock hand. There were several times in the dungeon where she was in there fighting with them. At one point Good in time, shit, my boy Nito was like, hey, That's put hard. up your sword. I need you to fight him barehanded. And it went like this. Damn, I can't believe I let my guard down. Oh, that hurt. Like, damn. I wonder if she saw that. Probably ain't never gonna give me no ass now. Oh, man. Don't you put your hand on my mask. Saw that. Probably ain't never gonna give me no ass now. Bro, why, baby? Look at this, bro. She had a 90 degree angle while looking back at you. Fuck this fight. Oh, just man. saying. Don't you put your hand on my master. I'm a beat your ass. <laughs> put your paws up, you wooden deal. Don't you touch my master. Not only did she prove she was capable of Bruh. the fisticuffs, but there was even points of times in the show where she protected him. She stood up and put herself mm. on the line to protect him, to make sure he survived. And she was always there to catch him when he- Hey, listen. She batting all right. But if they ain't doing this for you, bro, they ain't the one. Because the same way she look good, all the other ones look good too. You know what I'm saying? Which one provides more? Which one does more? You know what I'm saying? Fail. She was truly dependable. I ain't even gonna lie. I remember this one point in time where he went to another city so he'd be able to teleport there and it went like this. I hope he wasn't out there fucking no other bitch. Follow those boneless children. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to park that Big Mac truck right in this little garage. And it went like this. I hope you wasn't out there fucking no other bitches. I'm trying to swallow those boneless children. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to park that Big Mac truck right in this little garage. I want you to touch that dangly thing in the back of my throat. Well, hey, hey, why, hey, why are you falling? Yo, Aaron, Aaron, Aaron. <laughs> Aaron. <laughs> How do you feel saying this shit, bro? <laughs> What's, what happened? What's wrong? Why, why, what's happened? Why are you? Nah, bro. If it was me making videos like this and commentating, I'd die laughing, bro. No. No cap. Oh, no. I think Shorty had some. Why my dick hurt? Now, the next thing on the scouting report, our baby Roxanne was innocent. Now, you remember mm. the slave master? When our boy Micho first talked to him, it was really like this. She ain't never had a boyfriend. You know what I'm saying? Like, she, she, hey, look, she right. You know what I'm saying? Like, look, if you don't want her, I'll take her. I mean, you know what I'm saying? But look, look, I'm in the business of making people happy, making connections. You know what I'm saying? Look, i sell you to her. The roles were reversed. I'd sell you to her. Let's be honest. So, like, you ain't never have a boyfriend? I ever, 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 ever. No. Hey, I might Fresh tell you meat. a joke, but I never tell you a lie. And that really set the tone for who she was as a character. And we start seeing, oh no, this is really her. Shorty really is, you know, sweet. I remember when Good she shit. first got to the end, it went like this. I wonder why she's standing over there. She probably nervous. So, yeah, I mean, she ain't never have a, a real man for real. Look at me, I'm elegant.
probably nervous. So I mean, she ain't never had a, a real man for real. Look at me, I'm elegant, I'm strong. You know, I'm everything she need. But hey, come, come stand, come sit over here. What you standing for? Okay, master, here I come. Excuse me, let me let me just sit down. The next moment went like this, where you could cut the tension in a room with a knife, and we see the true innocence in her, and it went Word. like this. I wonder how she'll react if I show her the stick. No, I, I got a mallet for real. I got this sledgehammer. I got this sword of Ori Calcos. Let me see what she. Oh, yeah. He's pulling his up. Oh, my God. Where he trying to put that at? Man, why she look away? I, th I thought I was bragging for real. Then we had another moment in episode five where she was truly afraid that he was going to leave her to go back to his homeland. And I ain't gonna hold you, gang. I love waffles. It hit me right life. in the chest. Now, the next thing we gotta throw in a scouting report. I know this one is a little bit different from our other two, but the jiggle physics in <laughs> this show were by far the yeah. greatest jiggle physics of 2022. Wow. And the one thing we know about on this channel is jiggle physics, whether it be high school of the dead, high school DXD, prison school. We know about jiggle physics. This show had jiggly, a wiggly. mix of not too hey, much, yo. not too little. It was crazy. There were so many moments where when you're watching it, you like, what? Why is it like this? Bro, it's so good. Out, oh, bro. This <laughs> show made me realize something about myself. This like, crazy. I'm not down bad, but watching this show, I realize I'm willing to go to the depth of Yo, down bad. You're willing to simp, gang. You know what I'm saying? You're willing to break some rules, break some laws. Might as well. You're not saying for a little bit of poop because it just brought something out of me now that's the end of the scouting <laughs> report let's get into the stats let's solidify this right now her first stat is gonna sound crazy as hell but trust me when you watch the show you're going to understand she was his first lover now okay. i figured the show was just gonna All play right. around with the idea leave it to imagination you know leave you wondering like if this would ever happen if they would seal the deal like most animes do boy was i wrong in episode four it went like this i hope you know when we get home we can't just be looking this good and not expect me to want that oh it's all yours it was yours to begin with i playing with me before we get it on and popping what drake said let them open up the safe and up and up and up hey look look look, look. We, yeah, we, we yeah, yeah. arby dragons born this or well, that's what he said have them open up the safe hey look for you i'll get them to open up the safe stop playing with me Please relax, calm down. You looking too good, too scrumptious. Oh, stop playing. You know I'm ready for whatever. You ready for this? D you ready for this? D oh, you ready for it? Hold on. No, but I'm ready to take whatever you ready to give. And up to this point, I oh nah, nah, it's a different type of freaky gang. She said I'm not ready, but whatever you throw at me, I got you. <laughs> Man, that's some freak shit. I'm still thinking, yo, nah. This ain't what it's gonna be. They just, you know what I'm saying? We gonna boy. get a white screen transition. Cool. And boy, was I wrong. The first time they got it on, at that moment, I knew I was different because when I was watching this on Crunchyroll and I saw the sensor come up on the Crunchyroll screen, I was like, I don't feel that's right. The fact that this is going on, there's no audio for almost a minute here. Something gotta be going on. And that's yeah. when I realized I'm willing to go to the depths of hell to find the truth. <laughs> and I did find it. <laughs> now, gang, you gotta see what I saw. Sensor, you're not my ace. Hey, don't hate the play, hate the game. You gotta see Simple. that sensor, G. Now this next stat will hey, make you got the link in the description, gang, and not saying. Mama, I can know proud. Roxanne oh, is the top of the class 2022. Hey, and yo. if you don't get what I'm saying, you gotta see this moment here. They had a battle earlier that day. His finger got stabbed. It was like, damn, this finger kinda hurt for real. Like, God damn. Hey, suck it. Okay. Oh God. If she did that to my face, something else hurt. What hurt, master? My, my helmet. Got him. Now at this moment, it's all gravy. My right? helmet. Cool. No. Shorty said bet, and this this moment right here was crazy. I got you. No wow, shot. Wow, wow. Oh my hey, god. Yo. She's going crazy. What oh. the fuck, gang? Oh no! Wait, 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 wait. Oh, Aaron, Aaron, <laughs> Aaron, the commentation, bro. <laughs> Yo, don't Mikey pull up on you when you're recording, gang. <laughs> oh, I love it. 
That's hilarious, bro. I want a family with her. I'm not gonna lie to you. Bro. I know a lot of people like to leave things up to the imagination. When they removed the imagination from the equation, it was crazy. I don't know. That's this, wild. I see you. Why the boy loved the tie. I can't, I ain't even gonna lie to you. Now, will I ever divulge in that? Probably not, but I understand <laughs> it a little bit better now. Now, I know this next stat might rub a lot of y'all the wrong way, and trust me, I get it, but this time it's different. You remember in the last video where I said Akino wasn't the jealous type, and the fact she wasn't jealous yep. put her in the waifu hall of fame. Well, She's jealous. Roxanne, on the other hand, was the jealous Damn. type. No, I know that sounds conflicting. I mean, makes sense you feel me she's doing a lot for for the homie it's like i kind of want that loyalty back type shit you know what i'm saying so or expect that loyalty back so i feel her i know that sounds contradictory but hear me out this was a different this time it was truly different Roxanne, we actually got all of her she wore her heart on her sleeve she expressed her emotions yep. and so to see her jealous it was different from when we saw Rhea's jealous there were so yeah. many moments where her jealousy made us care about her even more like oh you're jealous yeah like you feel bad you feel me like oh shit i'm sorry you know what i'm saying as if i'm speaking like as if i'm him speaking to her like oh i'm sorry you know what i'm saying you've been loyal to me i gotta return that to you type shit you feel me it enhanced our feelings about this character it yeah. made us care about this character more the fact that she showed there was some jealousy there it made you feel she like cared. oh she genuinely cares about this person exactly. unlike with Riz, when we felt Riz get jealous from high school dxd it felt like she only cared about isay as a thing right as her possession this time yep. with roxanne it felt like she cared about him genuinely as a person and we w had shit. several moments in the show like this where she got jealous oh you a big strong man huh okay i see i see you with her but why don't you come with me look look look, look. you know i know i know how you adventurous be no oh, she don't throw hands hold on muscular and she don't throw hands frustration out on something excuse me ma'am here hit a leash back up off my man you uh. got that gorilla grip like i do so you can run <laughs> okay micho Tell her. Oh, 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 i'm not in this for real Just give us what we want i'm not in this for real okay? now that's why roxanne is the best waifu heard of you. 2022 and why she deserves you, to be you, in the waifu you. hall of fame now gang if you haven't seen check out the other waifu hall of fame videos as well as prepare yourself for next week's video because we're still getting wild let's get it gang you're not saying love you bro you feel me w she she's doing all this you know this good stuff but she cares you know what I'm saying? She cares. She don't want her, you know, her feelings broken and shit. And she's willing to ride. So <laughs> both ways. You're not talking about, but you get it. You get it. You feel me. W video, bro. That's my reaction. If you enjoyed, give this video a like, subscribe if you haven't. And I'm out.